Detroit and the Eden Market. Uh, at the start of the game today, we've got a card of honour for our league champions this season, the Eden Market. Uh, congratulations to you. Uh, no matter what happens today, we've got a hell of a lot to celebrate, so I'd like to see as many people...
Probably most importantly, the the end goal that it that it achieved. What are you what are you feeling right now? Um, well, first of all, I thought we were very good today. Um, I thought our aspects of our approach, um, the way we approached the game, and the way we managed the game throughout, um, we were excellent. And um, you know, we scored the goals at the right time. And um, yeah, pleased the performance. And um, it was good to um, you know get back onto winning ways, especially after conceding. And only picking a point up last week. So a long old season, not quite finished yet, but regardless of whatever happens, I'm sure we'll enjoy the night tonight at the presentation evening with the awards and and the fans. Um, I guess how do you how do you reflect so far on on the season? I think I think so far, um, you know, you, you look back to pre-season. Um, I mean, um, we, we reported back. Me and the gaffer sat down, and um, you know, the targets were set. The gaffer says he wanted um, playoffs. Um, I fully believe we could achieve that. And um, you know, to be sitting here today, knowing that we've achieved that, um, to finish fourth in the league is a, is a fantastic achievement for the football club, and it just shows, um, you know, how aligned we all are. Um, you know, from from recruiting players, from taking us through the season, from the support that we've had. Um, yeah, you know, it's, it's a fantastic achievement and we're, we're absolutely delighted with it. I wanted to touch on the alignment, actually. Um, everyone seems incredibly together at the moment. Obviously, it's always easier when results yeah. go your way and, and you achieve the playoffs. But, I mean, that must be incredibly important heading into... What are games where it can go any which way, but when you're together, I suppose anything can happen. Yeah, of course it is. I mean, you know, I've, I've always said it's always about the group. Um, it's not about individuals. It's always about the group, and everything we do is based on the benefit um, of the group, basically. But I look back, um, you know, and we've we've been through tough periods. Um, I've got to mention the chairman, Dave. Um, you know, the support he's given me, uh, myself. Um, you know, the backing, um, you know, I'll always be grateful for that. And, you know, it's big for Dave. This is, um, yes, he's the chairman of the club, but, you know, I think um, being able to deliver this for him as well as the fans, um, you know, I take great pride in that. So moving on, we'll enjoy tonight, but then I imagine your focus will very quickly switch if it's not already to uh, Wednesday night. Played them three times uh, already this season, so familiar with with them. Um, I guess how do you how do you prepare for for a game like that? We obviously prepared well today when we knew what was at stake. So yeah, I think preparation is key, and that's one thing that we do. We, we do prepare well um, for each game, and you know it'll be no different for Wednesday. 
So, look, Leamington are a very good football team. Um, you know, they've got some great people. Um, you know, Paul Holleran, you know, he's a great guy, good manager, knows the level, very experienced. And, you know, yeah, look, um, total respect to Leamington. I know how tough it was going to be on Wednesday night, but look, we're looking forward to it. And, you know, we're just going to go there and give it our best shot, enjoy the occasion. And, um, you know, again, we're relying on the supporters turning out in their numbers, which I'm sure they will do. Uh, but yeah, look, it's a great occasion um, all round and, you know, we're really looking forward to it.